Okay. Hello, YouTubers. <clears throat> I still have no teeth yet, so don't look at me. I'm going to try not to show myself very much anyways. I am back. It's been a while, I know. But it is hard for me to do vlogs when I can't include my family. And my family is always at home with me. So it's hard to find times to do vlogging. But I am here by myself right now. Everybody's gone. So I'm jumping on it. <laughs> Alright. Uh... Today is, what is today? I have a bad memory, bad mind, I don't know, so i got to look. Saturday, December the 29th, 2012, and it's nighttime, it's 8.11 p.m. at night, and I am going to show y'all, I'm in my living room, now my living room is not completely cleaned up, so don't look at the nastiness, but... And with the light shining, I know you can't really tell. That's that end of my living room. So there's my Christmas tree. All the presents are gone because it's after Christmas. Let me turn this light out and see if it shows the tree a little bit better. It's still like one big blurry light, ain't it? I need to get you closer to it so you can kind of really look at it. Let me see what this does as we go closer to it. And I hope you can hear me good because... I hope my volume is up loud enough is what I'm saying. Okay. There's the tr the star. And then you go down the tree. And if I stop moving it and let it focus. See, I'm not a very good vlogger. All my vlogs are blurry, I know. Fast movement and stuff. It's all It's a white tree and it's all white lights. And then it, the balls on it is like blue and silver and they're sparkly like with glitter on them and so that's the tree now I'm gonna have to cut the light back on and you might can even see it better let me turn the light on and get up close and let you see it see if that lets you see it any different or any better the star you can't really tell what the star looks like unless I can get really close let it focus good. There's the star. And then as you back up and slowly go down the tree. I'm letting you see. Okay, I'm going to tell y'all some things I got for Christmas. We had a good Christmas. I hope all of y'all did. And, um, I want to show you some things I got for Christmas. Okay. One of them that I'm really excited about, and it's kind of given me a challenge, <laughs> something to do. As y'all know, I love scrapbooking. So this right here, Albert got it for me. See, I can't see. Let me see if I can look in the mirror. I'm looking in my mirror screen on the wall. That right there. That is a scrapbooking calendar. And as you can see, the date on it, I can't see. I got to look. See, I'm on my laptop and I'm having to hold it. And I don't know if it's focusing. But the date on it is Monday, December the 31st of 2012. That's when it starts. And it, it says, cheers, cheers. Counting down to midnight. I'm supposed to cut all those little things out. This right... I don't know if it's showing it good. Let me see if I can hold it and aim it and keep it still. This is a frame. See, that? that's a border of the frame that I would... I'd cut it out and put a picture in it. I'd fix all this on a page to put in a picture album. And the picture would go inside the frame. Then I would cut all these things out and glue them, you know, around in there on the page decorating it up. And so, yes, one scrapbooking picture a day to scrapbook on a page and put in an album. That's going to be a challenge, but I'm excited and can't wait to get started on it. Sorry, Budgie, you don't need to go back there. Um, I'm going to give it a try. I'm going to go for it and try it and see if I can do it, and I'm excited about it. Okay, I got a lot of little bitty uh, smash book. 
accessories that goes with Smash, Smash Books for Christmas from Albert and the girls, too. And then I got, I'm going to set my camera down and put back up and put this on. And maybe y'all can see it. This is from my oldest sister, Charlotte. This is what she got me for Christmas and sent it to me. I can't tell. That's the inside because the tag flips back. I can't tell which is which. So that's the inside. So you flip it like this, or I do. Put it on so the tag's in the back. And it just drapes over your shoulders. It's for when you're just sitting around, lounging around, reading in this cold winter weather to keep you warm. Now it does have pockets. So has no buttons, no snaps, no zippers. It's just a drape over your shoulders and keep you warm. And it's a bluish color. It's almost, you know, purple. I thought when I first seen it that it was purple. But now I can tell that it's really blue. So I got that from my sister. My oldest sister, Charlotte, and then my middle sister, which is older than me, too. But I call them oldest sister and middle sister. My middle sister, Becky, she's into scrapbooking like I am. And so she made me this. It's a little bitty scrapbook. And she put some ribbons on it. And, um, and then it's the page here which she's got they, their pockets each oh i'm sorry i didn't even have it in view she's got flowers on it made out of felt and each page is a pocket at the top and she made a tag she's got a button on this one and she put it in there and the way i'm going i'm afraid this vlog's going to be really long but hopefully i can get it done before my family comes back home it is late at night and they could get home on me before I'm through. But this is the other page. It's like a little scrapbook. I could put pictures in these pages and journal about the little pictures. All right, there's that one. And it's got some little, I think that's flowers. No, that's like a little fairy girl. But it's, uh, I'm trying to get close and let it focus. And it won't focus. I can't be still, so therefore it won't focus. Can you tell the fairy girl? And then up above is a flower right there. That focused better, so you may can see it better like this. I don't know. Anyway, this one has a tag with a, a button. Okay. All right. Let me turn that page. And she's got hearts on that one. Okay. Over here she's got a star. Glittery star. And then this one has. That kind of a button on it. And. It says at the bottom. It says life is about using the whole box of crayons. Because it shows a crayon there. Alright. Then. Turn that page. Oh, and there's a high heel shoe. I love it. <laughs> okay. Oh no, that looks like that got wet. She sewed she also sewed around these pages. And that's neat. I think that's neat. It's so cute. Alright, that one has like a big flower on it, and it's a tag in the pocket with another button and it's just so cute now if I can get this back in there and pretty that's my hair hanging out <laughs> then turn the page and that's the back of it and she stamped it she's got this stamp that says handmade by Becky she signs it under it the stamp says handmade and then she signs her name under it and so I want to get a stamp like that where I can do that on the stuff I make. Okay, that was from her. All right. Oh, uh, what else did I get? Trying to think and look around and see what I got that I can pick up and show y'all. Oh, I got some little. See, I have a little mini laptop. Whoa, my tape player's gonna fall here. Let me catch it. Oops. Sorry about that, y'all. All this stuff is sitting on this stuff, and I'm going to lose it. I don't know. 
it's speakers for my see i got a mini laptop and the volume in it is not very loud so it's speakers and they got hoodows on them i love hoodows now i'm into hoodows i still like my pigs but i like i'm liking the hoodows too now so it's little bitty round speakers with hoodows on them and see they have the little stands for them to set up and i plug it up to my laptop and that makes my volume louder so i got that um i'm not gonna be able to show you everything i can kind of tell you i got a game and it's called the name of the game is um oh, five second rule yeah and um what else did i get come on sherry think oh i got a big cube of lotion hand lotion and it's the um i'm reading it fresh cucumber melon is the name of it um okay i'm trying to think what else oh i got some scrapping stuff scrapbooking and some crafting stuff one of them is a box of jumbo craft sticks like popsicle sticks that i can use to make stuff out of you can use all kind of stuff to make stuff out of it um i got two shirts that um it's a certain kind of shirt they don't have a button they don't have snaps zipper nothing like that they don't have pockets in them either you put it on their long sleeve but they're really soft and cozy and warm i love them just to lounge around in here with but um they're to wear out you know to town and to church and all and i will but also that's how comfortable they are but you wear like a tank top or a short sleeve shirt that's not loose it's kind of close to you so that well it's the way i have to do it so i don't feel so bundled up to wear something on top of something but i put it on and it's kind of sort of like this but it has the long sleeves and it drapes around you but then instead of it's not well it's long but not square long like this wrap my sister got me and it's not it's short in the back but then it comes around in the front is long and kind of pointed you know it's cut in a point down there so it's cute I love it, and you can just wrap it around. you got two of them. One's purple, and one's gray. Okay. Oh, I got something else I can show you. Let me run here in the kitchen and get it. Um, I got the red M&M coffee cup for Christmas. And I also got... I haven't even took this one apart yet. It's still together like it was in the box. It's another cup, but it's hoot owls again. And it's a bowl and it's a saucer. And uh, I gotta wash them and put them up so I can use them. Um, so I got that for Christmas. Okay, I'm trying to think what all else did I get. I had a good Christmas. I done pretty good. I got candy. You know, it's hard to think when you're trying to think right off what all you got and show everything that you got. But anyway, so I did good for Christmas. Now, the next thing that I want to do and show you here is what I'm doing for my aunt for Christmas. I am making her. I'm going to have to bring this over here to show you. Let me move my stuff off of it. I got some scrapbooking paper laying here that I was using to work with to make her some stuff. Alright, see this box? I'm going to have to get me a bigger box. But it's a box, and as you can see, let me turn it like this so you can see. Um, I wish I could. I wish I had a good camera I could see good. All right, it's a box of food, can and box foods that don't perish on you fast that I can send to her through the mail. She don't have a lot of money and can't get a lot of food, so I want to do this for her. See, I got her some microwave things. Crackers and cheese it snacks and snack mix, rich crackers. Um, I got her pop tarts. I got her canned stuff. Some uh, jif jiffy cornbread mix. These noodles you can fix in the microwave. I got her some cereal. She loves cereal. Cinnamon toast crunch and um crackers. And I even got her macaroni and cheese down there. And I, like I said, I got her some canned stuff. It's not all fitting in here good. So I'm going to have to get a bigger box to fix that better. 
Plus, what I'm going to put in the box, I'm going to set it right here on this. So I'm going to show you this. I found this cute little calendar that I love. And it's got some fun, encouraging sayings in it. And I thought, because my aunt, she gets down and out. She can't get out much. And so she does get down and out and depressed sometimes. So I found this cute calendar that I'm going to put in the box with the food. And it says, it's a 2013 calendar. Life is all about how you handle Plan B. And so that's the front of it right there. And when you open it up, uh, for January, it says life is all about, well, that's the same thing on the front. But it has cute, I'm not going to read them all. That's the long, that's telling you about the calendar, basically. All right, but when you turn it, let me, that's really a lot too. Trust your crazy ideals. That's for February. Let me turn like this. All right. March is art does not have to match, art does not have to match your sofa. And I love that one because <laughs> I'm not about, about matching. I'm about all different kind of colors and designs. To me, that's what's pretty. All right. If you want rainbows, you got to have rain. See, it's encouraging sayings. I love them. That was April. Okay, May says, we know why be a queen when you can be a goddess? So that's May. All right, June says, never underestimate the power of a hissy fit. I like that too. <laughs> Woo! Okay, July. Flip-flops. Oh, I like this one, too. I'm a flip-flop girl. <laughs> flip-flops make your toss, make your toes feel like they're on vacation. So, I like that one. And they got it's got some pretty pictures in here, too. Okay, um, August. When life becomes a roller coaster, climb into the front seat, throw your arms in the air, and enjoy the ride. <laughs> okay, September which is my birthday month. Age is nothing but a state of mind. And so it kind of, talking about age and September being my birthday, it kind of goes along. I know I'm giving it to Bill. It should have been in July when her birthday is. <laughs> but anyway. Okay. October. Wish, wish, hope, dream. Then make it happen. Okay. All right. November. Follow your dreams with your arms flaring, your hair flying, and screaming at the top of your lungs. Okay. And then December of 2013. Stop what you're doing and start living. So that's that one. And then that's the back of it, and it shows all the different pages in the calendar. But I'm giving her that in the box with all the food. Plus... Let me get this tied back up. I am making her some crafts. I'm crafting her some stuff. Now this here is a box that some Christmas cards came in. And I'm using it to put these little things in that I am crafting her. So I'm going to open it and show you. Alright, now I did buy her this little, it's a notepad. And it looks like a little purse. Green is her favorite color. So, i seen it, and she loves little stuff like this, just like I do. And uh, me and her have a lot in common. She's my aunt. I'm her niece. She's 15 years, years older than me. We laugh alike, and we like all the things just alike. And we look alike. People say I look just like her. A spitting image of her. But it's notebook paper in there to write in, and it's pretty. Okay. Um, so, I did buy her that and put it in this little box. Now, let me show you what I've made her. I've made her this, which is a little book. It's made out of scrapbooking paper that has, but I had to look at it to see. I can't see backwards good in the camera. Butterflies on it. And I made it to say with stickers, this away, read this away, journal. So this is a little journal, and I've got a big paper clip thing here. But I put stickers on it, you know, a flower, and then the... That's banner stickers, and then the letters is on top of it, or pendant, they call it. 
that you can make ban banners with. And then there's another flower sticker that I put on it. Okay, take the little uh, paper clip off and it opens up. And if you notice, there's a paper clip there. It's a green one. When you open it this way, you can write in it. It's got little journal spots, so that's like you can put the date there. But you can also clip papers, write on little papers and clip them to this in there. And there's another little spot to write some stuff and clip papers on that one. And then it opens up like this. And you've got these two to write on, your paper clips to clip stuff on. I put stickers in there, flowers and stuff. And then it'll open up, this one opens up like this. And you have more journaling spots and clips and flower stickers to clip stuff on. Um, the two in the middle, you can do something to get to that. And then you fold that one over. This was one paper and it said notes. And I cut it in the middle and glued it on each side so that it would be like that. And uh, then I have the paper, the paper clips up there to clip other stuff. And then you turn it like this. And I got that one. It has a B on it. And then the flower and these little bitty things here to write something on. And the paper clips to clip stuff on. And then you close it and that's what the back looks like with that big sticker. So I made her that little book. Okay, <clears throat> and then I've made her another little book. Let me put this back in here. And this is what it looks like. It says, Bill's Diary. And I got heart stickers. This is made out of a box, people. Can you believe it? I'm sure you can. I watch videos of people crafting all the time. And a bunch of ladies makes, you know, books, journal books like this out of boxes, cereal boxes and stuff, but this is one of the little bitty boxes that the flavors that you put in bottled water in uh, comes in. So I use that. I've tied a ribbon here, and I've got two little strands of beads hanging there on it, and then the back I put the sticker of the butterfly on it. And then I've got it closed with a little bow ribbon with Hello Kitty on it. And uh, you just untie that to open it. And um, open it up. You have to be careful because I just have that ribbon glued right inside of it. You see, i got the pretty paper in here covering up the box like I did on the outside. And then I've got pretty scrapbooking paper inside. That's not going to focus good. I'm trying to... It's pink and it's got flowers all over the paper. I wish it would focus good. I don't know why it's not. I don't know if I need to get further away or up close. But anyway, that's a page. And you open it up. And there's another one. And I got clips on them. And different... On the, white, on the backs of them where it's white, I did little stuff. So that's like a little pink ribbon and then it's made out of paper though the paper clips you turn it paper clip there for that one and that's kind of a tannish brownish color with flowers and leaves on it and then my back is hurting standing here like this doing this on this one I've got washi tape to decorate it up all right on this one, I've got a purple button, and it matches the purple paper over here. I tried to match up like that on all of them. All right, this is a yellowish-orangish or peachish color diamond over here to go with the paper of flowers over here. All right. This is a butterfly hair clip for little girls that's real pretty, but I'm using it as like a clip, too. And then this is like a grayish color flowers. Then I got some, that's paper buttons, and then a, a, well, a flower, a button, and a heart. It's all buttons, but one's like a flower, and one's a regular button, and one's a heart, and then paper. And then in here, that was stencils I had, and I just did it. That's not really that pretty. And then you can see how I had it tied with the string on there to tie my pages in. <clears throat> and then there's that. 
And this here is actually a bobby pin, but it's blue and glittery. And I'm using it for a clip. All right, now there's that side. See, I had the papers folded, so it's going back over the same ones. That's a panda sticker that's actually 3D. As you can see, it pokes out. Okay. Oh, yeah, this is hurting my back. All right, there's the peach one again. And I got a green paper clip. And then here's another purple one. And I've got a little bitty clothespin on there. And I painted it with purple fingernail polish. All right. The pink again, I got a little stamp down there of a lady. And it's like she's uh, embroidering or cross stitching or something. All right, then this is like this is a Brad, and it's of a little monkey, and the guys wiggle and move. And so you can see the back of the Brad right there. And then this is another clip. It's, one, it's them kind that's shaped like stuffed animals. So this is like a koala bear, and it's holding its baby on its back. And then that side, you can see the rest of it like that. And then that's the back side with the ribbon tied on it. Okay. So, I'm also making her another book. Let me come back over here to show you. I'm making her another book. I'm not through with it. It's going to be another journal type book. But it's, uh... See, it's made out of... See, you can see I hadn't covered the middle up yet. So, it's the drink thing that you put in bottled water. Peach mango, my favorite kind, one I drink the most of. Um, so peach mango drink mix is right there. I don't know if you can see it. But if you see the outside, this one is blue. This is crepe paper. And I decoupage it on there with Mod Podge. So I haven't decorated the front and named it yet or anything. And then this is the pretty papers I have on the inside. And then the pages, I've still got to cover this up, and the pages that I'm making for it is actually toilet paper rolls. Let me get them there over here. This is them. And uh, that's the paper. And it, it'll turn like this. See the ends? I didn't cover the ends up. Because that's what's going to go inside. I'm going to tape it with duct tape to the middle inside of that book. And it'll go... Let me stick it and hold the book up here so you can see. It'll be like this. Okay. That's the front. You'll see it from the top. Okay. And then when you open it, that'll be the first page. And then you'll turn it, which, to, being toilet paper rolls, there'll be pockets. And I'm going to stick little papers and things in them. Or you can make tags and stick in them like my sister did. That little thing. But there's a pretty page. And there's a pretty page. And then you turn it. And there's a pretty page. And there's a pretty page. And then you turn it again. And there's a pretty page. And like I said, with them being... And then i got to decorate the front and back and put the name on it and all that and fix a closure for it. Because these don't want to stay closed very good, as you can see. So they have to have closures on them. But yeah, this being toilet paper rolls, you can see they're open. I did fold them up and I taped them with duct tape to so that closes the bottom. So things won't go straight through. And uh, then I put the pretty paper on it. But the tops left it open for pockets so that you can stick she can write a bunch of papers and stick them down in there and I'm going to stick her some papers and stuff in there <sighs> may make them like little tags or something okay that's not the right way it goes like that alright so that is what I'm making her that and I'll put that in the little box that I'll put in the big box with all the food and stuff and if we can't go down there to Mississippi where she lives then I will um mail it to her um if we get to go down there which i'm hoping we do because i'd like to see her then i'll just um take it to her and that'll be her christmas gift for me all right i'm gonna go 
and I will see y'all later. Toodaloo until next time. Bye, YouTubers.